So the cameras, the city and Heidi Brothers that this is real. All new here at 530, the rally and protest over one of the city's best known coffee shops. Employees at Heine Brothers Coffee announced they will soon hold a vote to officially become a union after the locally owned coffee shop is closing one Highlands location. At the federal building in downtown Louisville this afternoon, baristas say they filed a petition with the National Labor Relations Board for an election. If granted, voters across 17 Kentuckiana stores will get to vote yes or no. The coffee company says it will cooperate with the federal government on this. Right now, Isaiah Kim Martinez and our chief photojournalist Phil Merle are live downtown to break down what this means for the future and what's next. Isaiah? Well, Doug Shea, it's what's called a secret ballot election used if a company doesn't voluntarily recognize union efforts. Now, baristas would need just a simple majority voting yes to bring the union to fruition. Driving around Louisville, you'll start to see these signs posted in front of homes. I think it's all about human dignity, really, you know? Those showing support for a union effort, gaining steam by the day. When we fight, we win! Heine Brothers Coffee employees are betting on themselves and doubling down. We will fight for our union and we will win. On Monday, dozens of baristas announced they've filed a petition for an election through the National Labor Relations Board. If given the OK, a majority vote from workers will be all it takes to green light unionization. We're just pumped. We're excited. Everybody is ready to go. Everybody is ready to get down there and vote in person. It's being done in partnership with NCFO, SEIU, and established Louisville Labor Union. We're confident, yes. This is their time. Uh, this is something they've fought extremely hard for. They put it so much time in. It's the next step in an effort that started back in April when several employees announced their intentions. They cited low pay and poor working conditions. Frustrations were further ignited at the start of July when Heine Brothers announced their Douglas Loop location would be closing. Employees accused the company of doing this in retaliation to union forming efforts. Last week, workers filed an unfair labor practice lawsuit and were given very, very little notice to either transfer to another store or accept severance. Meanwhile, the company says the allegations aren't true. In a statement Monday, a Heine Brothers spokesperson telling us, quote, we intend to defend the company's legal rights. The company also says while it respects the workers' choice to organize, it's declining their request to recognize the union. 22-year-old barista Aaron Bone says he's confident the vote will be successful. I can't think of a single person at my store who wasn't on board for it. And the crowd in downtown Louisville Monday agrees. And I'm told the Labor Board, Labor Board could grant that petition within the next week or so. That would put the election within the next month. Live here in downtown Louisville tonight, Isaiah Kim Martinez, WHAS 11 on your side.